guys, what we have here is the brand new 2013 Azuri Forza SL. Now you might be thinking the frame looks very similar, it is very similar. However, they've managed to shave off a little bit of weight, so 15 grams. So just slightly lighter. Um, the new graphics, I think, look fantastic. And they beautifully suit the new Dura Ace 11 speed group set, which has just arrived on the market. Now, I think this group set looks very, very nice. It all matches itself. Um, the crank looks similar to the brakes, the derailleurs. They all have that nice, beautiful surface, shiny finish. Now, to add to the fact that it's got an extra gear, uh, it's also lighter. So not only have they given you an extra speed, they've shaved off a bit of weight. Now, one of the ways they've done that is the crank arm has one less arm. So you'll see in the past, you remember, it used to have an arm that went across here. Now, Shimano have said that removing that arm and reinforcing the others has meant they've lost no stiffness. They've actually they've gained stiffness. So it's a lighter crank, um, which functions just as well, if not better. The new front derailleur works very well. You can see the very high pulley arm action there. And what that does is that provides you um, a drag position where you're not really going to get any rub. No matter what gear you're in, basically, you don't have to think about it. Um, so that's, that's an excellent feature. Now, I've ridden the bike. Um, as you can see, the bar tape there is a little bit dirty. Um, and I found that the new shifters actually are slightly smaller. Um, you know, the hand grips are slightly smaller. I felt like, even though I've got a fairly, fairly larger hand, that it felt like it fit perfectly. Now, I think as well, as fitting my hand well, I think it will actually fit people who might have struggled in the past with smaller hands, feeling like they were swimming. And I think that sh the, the feel of the, the shifter is excellent. And as I've also been riding the 10-speed Juros um, in the past, I feel like it is an improvement over the 7900 group set. Now, to finish the bike off, it comes with a Reynolds Solitude wheel. The Reynolds Solitude wheel we found to be very dependable um, and that weighs about 15, 90 grams. Now, we do offer the option on the website to change the wheels. You can change those to Durace if you choose, if you'd like to, li to lighten the bike further. This is a scale here. On the scale here, the bike weighs exactly 7.2 kilos. A 7.2 kilo. Now, if you put on a set of race wheels, you could easily get the weight down to 6.5 kilo. Now, for a bike um, price as this bike is, um, it's pretty much unheard of on the market to have a bike weighing 6.6 .6 kilo. So that's a fantastic feature. To top off, to top off the, the build, you've got a carbon seat post. There's an FSA SLK seat post, an FSA stem, FSA handlebar. That's a compact handlebar. We find most people fit a compact handlebar very well and a physique area and saddle. Now, the physique area and saddle seems to fit most people's bums the best. Um, we've had great feedback from the shape of this saddle. Overall, we're very impressed by the new Azuri Forza SL 2013, and we think you will be too. For more information on the bike, please see our website, cyclingexpress.com.